Welcome back to the channel once again, fam. Now things are taking a turn in the Mo 3 case. As reported, a second suspect has been arrested, and according to the docs, he's explained his motivation for the shooting. 28-year-old Devin Brown told officers that he knew Mo3 was seeing a known witness, and he was upset over a video posted on Facebook presumably featuring Mo3 and the woman. Brown, however, denied playing a role in the fatal shooting. He was indicted on murder charges for the death of the rapper on Wednesday, April 21st. Reports show that phone records identify numerous calls between Brown and 22-year-old Kawan Dontrell White on the day before and the same day Mo3 was shot. Cell phone data was able to place White near the apartment where Mo3 stayed the night, and it also showed him following a similar path of the rapper before he was shot. Alright, there's your recap. Now here's the part where it's taking a little bit of a turn. Since the news, the witness, Josie, has obviously been receiving backlash after backlash after backlash for not notifying Mo3 that these guys were allegedly plotting to kill him. Taken to her Instagram account, she exposed one fan's message, and the message was a question that I think we would all like to know the answer to. Why didn't you tell 3 your baby daddy was blowing up your phone trying to see if he was over there? Why you ain't do nothing? You ain't care for 3 because if you did, no matter who it was, baby daddy or not, no person would have been able to get close to 3. You trifling AF. Despite that being what you would think would be a pretty deep cut, her response was simply, Stop watching me, weirdo. Hmm. The fan, who I'm assuming is one of Mo 3's either old people, old flings, whatever you want to call it, then said, You can't even answer because you're sick in the head. I used to tell 3 to watch trifling women like you. Seemingly unbothered, the witness, Josie, then followed up with this response Baby Mo didn't have to mess around with me, and by the look of you girls, I think he was winning. Y'all wear fat ass vans. Now I know several have come to the realization that the spiritual reading from last year just may have some truth behind it. He, I keep hearing I knew it. I knew it. I saw it coming. He told you. He told me. You remember he said you live by gun, die by gun? He just said that yesterday to my cousin. That is so crazy. He said that. He said that. She said how he knew. Like, what did he know? Go. Yeah. He said he knew they was coming for him. Cause you, you was the quiet one on in bed. All three of you set this up, and I'ma tell the world. Quit trying to put it on kids. Talking about her, her son. Her son. How dare you? Is you out of your mind? Fuck. I keep seeing it. Your sister was texting her baby daddy, standing. In Hallway doing her feet like this, and he kept asking her, Is he still over there? Is that over there? I know he over there. Your sister text your baby daddy. I saw it plain and simple. Your sister, your sister, your sister did it. Your sister set him up. I don't give a Jocelyn. You text your baby daddy, bitch. I saw you on the phone. You were sitting in the hallway. Everybody was moving around your house, and I saw you standing in the hallway, bitch, texting. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. You keep talking about, we talked to Mo, Mo said we okay. Mo did not say that. Mo told his brother don't trust nobody, none of y'all. He said if it ain't his mama, he's not to trust nobody. The entirety of this story has been one hell of an emotional roller coaster, and it doesn't even seem like we've reached the climax just quite yet. Make sure to leave us your thoughts down below with what you think is going on with the right now and what the very near future may hold. All that said, we appreciate you guys as always for tuning in. Make sure to keep it locked here for the latest updates on this story and the next. And while you're here, if you're enjoying the content so far, make sure to smash that like button. And if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button and right to the right of that bad boy. Smash that bell icon for the latest notifications on this story and the next. And we'll catch you on the next go round. You guys be safe, because all the other bull is here today and gone tomorrow. There, I said it. <laughs> Peace.